Hi everyone, we've had more cloud cover today, still fairly mild in the temperature department, and now we've got rain showers developing mainly to the west of I-35, but we will be seeing those rain showers in central and parts of eastern Iowa as we go through the rest of the evening, overnight, and certainly through the day tomorrow. Everyone can expect to see at least a little bit of rain. It won't rain the entire time, but don't think you're going to get away from this being totally dry. Here's a look at our rain tracker. A good chance for Sunday, 70%. Monday will be dry. There is a slight chance of a sprinkle both Tuesday and Wednesday, but for the most part, they will be dry as well. Thursday will bring a little bit better chance for rain, a 40% chance as we get ready to go towards the end of the work week. I do want to track this for you hour by hour. We're going to be looking at temperatures dropping into the upper 40s this evening with rain showers expected off and on throughout the evening. The best coverage of rain still expected to come a little bit closer to midnight and certainly through the early morning hours tomorrow. I am expecting a low only to fall near 43, so not very cool rain likely off and on. As I've mentioned, the future tracker pinpointing this for you. We are going to be looking at those rain showers right over central Iowa and the metro around midnight. We will see a little bit better coverage of rain showers overnight. This is 3 a.m. where we could be dealing with that. Could even have a rumble of thunder, but that's not a guarantee. I do think by 6 a.m. still dealing with scattered rain showers. We'll be looking by 10 a.m. to continue dealing with that. So basically what's going to happen is it'll rain for a little while. Take a quick break and then we'll likely have some more rain. Notice though by the afternoon the coverage of that rain will likely be a little bit less and we will likely be drier going into Sunday afternoon. We could still see a few spotty showers Sunday evening, but I do think overall those rain chances will start to go down. By Monday morning, the clouds will diminish a little bit and we will dry out, perhaps see a little bit of sunshine to start our work week as well. So if you do need to get that car washed tomorrow, I would not do it. Rain is likely off and on throughout the day. Monday, Tuesday look pretty good. Then by Wednesday, we'll have another chance for some isolated rain showers, so I would get it done before then if you can. We are looking for that high near 51 on Sunday with the rain showers and Obviously, it's going to be cloudy, a little bit cooler than what we had today as well. Here's a look at the next 10 days for you. Highs in the mid 40s on Monday. Tuesday looks pretty decent overall. We'll have a little bit more cloud cover. Windy and warm for Wednesday. There is a chance of a few showers, maybe a few rumbles of thunder Thursday. It is possible we have one or two strong storms on Thursday, but I'm really not all that convinced of the ingredients just yet. And then I do think Friday could be wet with even a few areas potentially seeing a few snowflakes Friday as well. We'll continue to track this forecast throughout the upcoming week.